Well, greetings. I'm so glad you can join us. And uh, we are continuing our uh, series on um, First Things First, a uh, Bible study on Girls for Believers by uh, Katie Parks. And we are on Lesson 21. And that is, which church should you attend? Brotherly kindness can be best be developed by associating and worshiping with other believers in a local church. But which church should you attend? If you have come to Christ through a church other than your own, or you have no church background at all, or if you are already attending a church, you may be asking, what church should I attend? There are two questions to ask yourself. First, will your own spiritual life be nourished by attending this church? Second, should you go there to be a witness to family and friends even if you are not being spiritually fed? In this case, you may need to supplement your spiritual diet elsewhere. No one can make that decision for you. It's up to you. Whichever church you choose, you should at some point, make a public confession of your faith. Some churches make opportunity for this at their altar service or during a testimony sharing time or during a water baptisms. You should take these opportunities for public confession. Attend church at least once a week and gather with other believers to pray, to study God's word, to worship, and to witness. Meeting in a small group is good, but it is not good enough. You need to be a part of the local church. Ask God to guide you to the right place. Once you have chosen a church, become fully involved. Study the following references which describe the church at Thessalonica and list all the good things, attributes, beliefs, activities, you should look for in a prospective uh, church. So, and, so I thank you for uh, joining us and I uh, hope and pray that God will lead you and direct you to the church uh, that is uh, best equipped for you and to spiritually feed you and for you to be a, a testimony and a guiding uh a guiding light um, towards others who uh, may be looking for a church also. And uh, God bless you. And if you want to uh, contact me, you're welcome to email me or reply back. And, uh, and uh, have a happy Easter and Resurrection Day. God bless you.